And the sexism row in Ukraine after a government plan for women soldiers to parade in high heels. Ukraine's government has come in for some flack for asking its female soldiers to march in high heels. The country is holding a military parade next month to mark 30 years of independence following the collapse of the Soviet Union. Its plan to ask women to parade in heels has provoked outrage. The defence ministry said the shoes are just part of the uniform. The BBC's Jana Bespiachuk is in Kiev and says many battle-weary frontline soldiers are not impressed. The most interesting, important uh, reactions are in this case are uh, the opinions of the female officers who fought on the front line, who served in the army or have uh, or, uh, um, now work uh, in the ranks of the army. Uh, I spoke to some of them and they told me that uh, for them it's humiliating. Despite all these formal explanations of the defense ministry, which even posted um, the pictures of the other armies uh, parades um, in their social media accounts to prove that other armies also sometimes ask their w women uh, to uh, wear these high-held shoes. Uh, but despite all these arguments and reasons and explanations, uh, they think that they shouldn't be, uh, you know, uh, distinguished in that particular way uh, in the official ceremonies. Maybe uh, a, lo a lot is um, like uh, the, the big significance uh, is the war in Eastern Ukraine, in which women showed um, just as equals uh, very often to men in the battlefield.